Hello guys, welcome. I'm gonna be baking some banana chocolate chip muffins tonight and I'm so excited. Hello, hi guys, welcome. I love you guys. <laughs> So today I'm gonna to be making banana chocolate chip muffins and I'm so excited. Uh, I have everything laid out here and I'm gonna make them in front of you guys and hopefully they turn out well. I've baked two times previous from this and they didn't turn out each time. So, hello Mallory, hi guys. Um, we're just gonna get started. Um, so I'm gonna need a whole bunch of stuff and I have it all out here. And it says preheat the oven to 355. So I've already done that. And hello, Shelby. Hi, Angie. Welcome. We're baking tonight. It's gonna be a fun time. So it says preheat oven to 355. Already done that in a small bowl. Um, I just need to figure out. Okay. Thank you. Hi. Um, okay, I'm gonna mix it in this bowl. Um, so in a small bowl, combine flour, cinnamon, baking soda, and baking powder, and then set it aside. So I'm gonna go grab a small bowl. Hi, Addie. Hi, Jennifer. Okay, one second. I'm gonna go grab it. big this flour container is that I have. Isn't that crazy? Okay. So yes, chocolate chip banana, chocolate, banana chocolate chip muffins. I'm literally like, how do you say it? Um, and then I also picked out these cute little muffin holders. I don't know what they're called. So I'm going to put these all in here. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, Olivia. Hello, welcome. So I'm just putting all of the muffin, what are they called? What are these called? I don't know, I literally couldn't tell you. Hi, Alan. Oh man, I'm one short. I'm gonna have to get a different color. Okay. So in a small bowl, combine flour, cinnamon, baking soda, and baking powder. So I need, where's the flour? One and three quarter cups, okay. So, oh thanks. Okay, so one cup and then a three quarter cup after that. Oh my goodness, we need a knife. Literally don't have one, okay. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm literally a very hyper and loud person. Like if you know me from just like, just like working with me or something, you know that I'm like crazy. I'm very loud. Oh, of course. Hello, winter. Okay, so this is a cup. You guys can't even see that. This is a cup. Um, and now we need to do a three quarter cup um, of flour in here. I literally want to like not mess this one up because the last few times I have. Thanks. Oh, of course. I love talking with you guys. Oh no. Kirat. I'm so sorry if I messed that up. Gotta make breakfast. Oh, is it morning? I'm making banana chocolate chip muffins. Um, also, I'm using a steak knife, this is weird, but if you guys never know, when you guys get flour, you like push it up and then you like, I learned this in my like foods class, you go like that, and then you go like that. I really don't know why, but that's what I was taught, so that's what we do. Okay, now that the flour is in here, cinnamon, how much cinnamon? Half a teaspoon, okay. Grab these, half a teaspoon of cinnamon. Cinnamon right here. I'm gonna add that. 
Ooh, I love cinnamon. Reminds me of fall. Are you guys excited for fall or do you guys like winter that you're, I mean, not winter, do you guys like summer that you're kind of sad that summer is ending or are you excited? Because fall's a fun time. Aww. That's crazy, you just woke up. I'm just finishing my day. Okay, one second, I'm putting this away. Okay, now that the cinnamon's in there, I need to do baking soda and baking powder. So baking soda is half a teaspoon and you gotta make sure you don't mess this up. Okay, so this one's soda, right everybody? Soda, because we don't wanna mess this up. Okay, so half a teaspoon of soda. And then one teaspoon of powder. Um, currently, it is 6.02. Um, you're excited for fall because summer wasn't... I agree. It doesn't even feel like summer. Hello? Yeah, it's like 6... Yeah, 6 o'clock right now. Okay, so put this one away and then baking powder. I feel like it's really easy to mess these two up. It's 9 o'clock in the morning. That's crazy. Okay. Now, I'm gonna get rid of the remainder. Okay, one teaspoon of that, and then set this aside. So we got our little mixture here. I'll put this over there. I'm thinking of my next one. I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do another giveaway, but maybe, I don't know. Maybe if I hit 10,000, I could. Or like Christmas time, fall time. I know, I feel, yeah, I was supposed to go to Disneyland in September, like, coming up, and I can't go. I'm so sad. Disneyland's literally my favorite place ever. And the fact that I can't go is just so sad. <sighs> okay, so now, it says, in a large bowl on medium speed, beat sugar, eggs until creamy. Okay, so sugar, okay, I'm gonna grab this. Aw, good morning. Everyone, yeah, I feel like everyone had such fun, like, travel plans that got messed up. I really hope this whole thing could just be over now. Um, okay, sugar. We need, how much sugar? Three quarter cup, which is here. Got the sugar here. It is six o'clock p.m., so still the night time. Still uh, August 14th. Okay, so we got our sugar. That's a lot of sugar. Okay, pour that in there, um, along with eggs, and we need two eggs. Hello, I did post a um, skincare routine, um, it's on my channel, if you guys want to go check it out. 4 a.m., oh my goodness, your school starts on the 31st, <sighs> fun times, fun times. I kind of miss back to school. I don't, I'm not going back to school, but I kind of miss like going back to school shopping and I don't know, picking fun things out. Hello, and yes, I will. Oh, thank you. It's 9 p.m. Um, where are you from? That's kind of close to the same time zone as me, like three hours. Um, okay, and then eggs. I'm getting the eggs. And I need two. My favorite thing about fall, how cozy it is. The weather gets very like cold, not cold, but like rainy. So it's very cozy and just like drinking hot chocolate and going to pumpkin patch, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that this year. Maybe. I feel like everything's just gonna be weird this year. Okay, putting the eggs in here. Oh, I got a shell in it. I can literally see a shell inside of there. We're gonna need to get that out. Okay, one. All right. Let's see if we can find the shell in here because I'm not entirely sure. Okay. you all right I need to try and find 
the shell. I don't even know. Well, it wasn't that big, so it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, I definitely can't find it. Oh well. That's okay. Okay, now it says to beat this for two minutes. We're gonna have that on there. Alright, what's your guys' favorite thing to bake? What do you guys enjoy baking? I've never tried a pumpkin spice latte, and I'm trying to think of a video where I can incorporate me trying it for the first time because I've never tried it before. I got my dress from H&M and it was only $20. Literally so crazy. Brownies. Hello, Jody. Yeah. Cake. Yeah, cake is definitely very easy to make. Chocolate cake, so good. Aw, I usually do a live every Friday, so thank you. Okay, this is beating over here. Looking good. Okay, what's the next step? With a fork, mashed bananas. Okay, literally sour cream goes in this. Isn't that weird? Favorite Disney Plus shows. I really liked, I can't remember what it was, I can't remember what it's called. It's about how they like made Disneyland kind of. I can't remember what, Imagineer, is that what it's called? That's a really good series and it's so cute. So you definitely should check it out if you're into like Disneyland and stuff. Um, okay, in a medium bowl, mashed bananas. So I have some pretty nasty looking bananas. Aw, thank you. That's so sweet. <laughs> okay. These are kind of gross. The Starbucks pumpkin spice. My mom's obsessed with it, so I definitely should. My favorite Disney movie. Ooh. I don't know. I really like Cars. That's literally one of my favorite movies. It is so cute. Strawberry cake or brownies? Do I believe that Annabelle doll is real? Did you just say Oh my goodness, ew, I hope not. That'd be so scary. I should do a live stream where I where I make them or I go and get them and try them. Was it hard doing YouTube in the beginning? Yeah, I my first video I literally sat down for like probably like four hours trying to figure out how to talk to a camera. It's like I didn't think it'd be that hard make them that could be fun i'm thinking about doing a video where i make starbucks drinks i've done it before it was really fun um yeah so i would literally i was standing in front of the camera like sitting in front of the camera trying to film like this like little haul that i did and i was like why can i not talk i was getting so frustrated and i wasn't gonna post the video because i was getting so frustrated but i ended up doing it um august 19th Probably in the morning sometime. I'll post it on my community tab. Okay. This one. Uh, my channel, I feel like it's growing it, like slow and steady. Like I feel like I never, like I know a lot of people who started around the same time, they just kind of like blew up a little bit and mine has never been like slow but like it's just been like steady like I have never like peaked and like got a million views on a video but yeah which I think is good because then you're kind of being authentic and the people who actually want to subscribe to you are actually subscribing for the right reasons I feel like thank you okay I'm mashing the bananas right now kind of looks kind of gross but smells real good um, I always, oh my goodness, I just got banana on my forehead. I always wanted to start a YouTube channel. Um, I don't know, I was sitting with my mom, because like 2020 had just started, and I was sitting with my mom for a cup of coffee, and I was like, I'm just gonna do it. Like, I don't know what's gonna come from it, but may as well. What do I got to lose? I was this age. I only started YouTube in January, so I'm very, very, very new. 
Um, okay. Mash the bananas, add sour cream, oil. Okay. Sour cream. How much? This is so weird that you put sour cream in a baking recipe. Hello? Okay, here we go. How much do we need? Three tablespoons. That's a lot. Aw, oh, thank you. My favorite color is pink. And Netflix, probably Friends, and I'm, I'm re-watching Gossip Girl right now. Thank you. I got it from H&M. Um, I'm re-watching Gossip Girl right now. Forgot how much that show is, like, so amazing. If you guys have never watched it, I highly suggest it. My first video was, um, I was just talking about, like, some clothes that I had gotten. That's it. Like, a little haul. But I was so nervous. Okay, we got one tablespoon in there. Now we have another one. And three. Aw, oh, thanks. It's expensive? Where? How much is it? How did I start? I just made like a little video on some clothes that I got. Literally, that's it. And I just posted it to see what would have happened, and I just, I really enjoy it. I love it so much, um, and I literally feel like YouTube is the reason it got, like, it got me through, like, quarantine and the coronavirus and stuff. Like, it kept me so, like, occupied that I don't know what I would have done without it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> um, okay, so the three tablespoons of sour cream is in. Um, I'm going to add the bananas inside now. Oh, that made a gross noise. Okay. That's in there. Now I need oil and vanilla. How do you know what to make YouTube videos on? Um, usually just stuff that's interesting to me and like trending stuff that I feel like people would actually want to see. And no, I'm not in college. You should. If you guys are thinking about starting a YouTube channel, I definitely suggest you doing it. And yes, I have two dogs. I agree, right? Sour cream inside muffins? I don't know, kind of odd. I've made cookies with sour cream before, um, but there are muffins, but here we go. Okay, um, oil, how much oil do you need? A quarter cup, one fourth, not a quarter. I wish I could share these with all of you guys once they're ready. All right. Okay, pour that in there. And then vanilla is last. And we need a half a teaspoon of vanilla, which is here. Do I have, I have, in, I have all of the social media platforms, I feel like. Yeah, of course. I can totally do a house tour. Like, I don't own this. Would it be weird? I don't own this house. Like, my parents own it. Would you still want to see a house tour? I'm not in college. Nope. I am just working away. Okay. My, well, my mom is, she definitely likes to clean a lot. When the house is just getting a little bit dirty, she's like, okay, let's go. And she goes and cleans. She literally goes on like a spree, like every week. She just goes so crazy. Okay, and then a half a teaspoon of this. All right, that just dripped all the way down. Um, yes, I do. You have to meet some requirements to make money on YouTube, um, but thanks to you guys, I did. <laughs> okay, now, that kind of does not look very good, but I feel like once I add the dry mixture, it will. Okay, add flour mixture, 
gently with a spatula to combine. Okay. Okay, we're almost there. My favorite food would probably have to be pasta or chicken strips. Can never go wrong with either. You can go to a restaurant, any restaurant, and if you order pasta or chicken strips, you'll never be disappointed. Ever. That's my little my little trick. Can I post the recipe? Yes, of course. I just got it off of Pinterest. Um, I just typed in banana chocolate chip recipe. But um, once this live is over, um, I'll link it into this video so you guys can try it out for yourself. If it turns out, who knows? Okay, I'm gonna mix this up a little bit. Like the flour mixture. And then... You're having fun? Aw! Please do a school supplies shopping vlog. Oh, that would be so much fun. Aw, thanks for coming to my live stream. It seems early? Yes, it is only 6.18 at night, so it's still decently early. Okay, that literally looks like water, so hopefully this helps a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna do that to start. Do you guys like cooking or baking better? Or neither? Which one do you guys like? Oh, that was all of it. Okay, sure. We'll just go with that. Baking for sure. Yeah. I feel like, what website am I using? Um, it's called Valentina Sporner, but I just found it off of Pinterest. I'll link it once this is over. Baking. You like both? But I feel like I'm not the best at cooking, but baking, I just feel like it's easier. Oh, so good. So, so good. Okay, guys, this is looking, this is looking pretty good. I hope this turns out. Okay. Then... I'm gonna take a spatula. Where did it go? Okay, and I'm gonna get all of this off. Oh, you can see the little cinnamon specks in here. Reminds me of fall time. I've never made a pumpkin pie before and I kind of want to make one for the fall this year. I don't know how it would turn out, but we'll see. That should be good. Good enough. Take this off. And okay, I don't know if you guys can see it. How's it look? Hi, hi Matt. <laughs> One for Thanksgiving. Oh, that would be I I think I might. I think I should. Definitely baking. I'm scared. I know, right? It's so scary. Yes, I do like to bake. Okay, so now it says that I have to add in chocolate chips, which I have some Hershey ones right here. So I'm gonna open it up. Red velvet cake. I've never made that, but yes, that is one of my favorites. Um, it will be um, just like a random name generator. No, it's not the same recipe, Matthew. <laughs> I work with Matt. He's talking in the group chat as well. <laughs> um, I'm making banana chocolate chip muffins. And it'll just be a random name generator. And then I'll just reach out to the person on Instagram. I should do a sleepover. Oh, that'd be fun. How am I so organized? Well, I lay everything out to start out with. And then, it. I mean, it looks kind of messy. In here, trust me. Okay, there goes the chocolate chips. So good. Yes, I do. I am a office manager at a restaurant and a part-time, I like help out on the floor as well. Um, but I'll be moving into like the full-time position in November. Can I please do another giveaway? Yes, I definitely can. In the future, yes. I know a lot of people don't have Instagram, so I feel bad, but I feel like if you don't have Instagram, you can still enter. I don't want to make anyone not be able to enter. So if you don't have Instagram, 
that's okay too. You guys can totally enter as well. Um, okay. Okay, we got the spoon. Hello, Princess Elise. Is that how you say your name? Do you do shoutouts for YouTube channels? Um, what do you mean? Like, what kind, what kind, like on like my video? Maybe I can start doing that. I know you did. That is so sweet. Making an Instagram. So, so sweet. Okay. We're mixing in the chocolate chips right now. It's looking good, guys. Hopefully, these turn out. All right. Oh, painting could be fun, too. Aw, so sweet. Okay. It is currently 6.23. So what I'm gonna do, I think, I think using an ice cream scoop to do this type of stuff is the easiest. You're my number one fan. Wow, thank you, Winter. That is so nice. Okay. So this is what it looks like out of 10. What do you guys think? This is literally gonna fall out of the thing. Um, and then I have this. I need one more, I'm missing one. I'll have to go grab it. Um, and then I will fill these up and we'll see how they look. All right. So I think this is the easiest way, honestly, to do it. The ice cream scoop kind of like gets, ooh, that was too full, I think. How full does it say? It doesn't really say, but I'm gonna say that first one was way too much. So we're gonna try and do about half of that. Yes, I can. I can definitely bring you a muffin later. No, I um, work at a uh, restaurant as well. Um, is Kyle good at art? Um, I've never really, actually I've seen him draw before, but he's just like me. We're not the best at drawing. <laughs> but I give him an A plus for trying. Okay. These smell good, you guys. Like, very good. Okay. She's all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm all right. Watch these all overflow, like, in the oven. Now that would not be good. They kind of smell like cinnamon buns, literally. I do, I have two dogs, a girl dog and a boy dog, and their names are Sam and Sophie, and they are my children. I literally treat them like they're my kids. And I take pictures of them all the time, and that's pretty much a lot of the stuff that I post on Instagram, like on my stories. Oh, I love you too. Um, it is just this one that I found on Pinterest, um, but I'll link it in the description of this live stream once the live stream is over. And then you guys can try these out. Well, if they turn out, then you guys can try them. But I'll definitely give you the inside scoop of if these are good or not. Okay, almost done putting them in here. And then they bake for around 20 minutes and then I'll do a taste test for you guys you don't like dogs oh that's okay that's fine oh you're gonna make these muffins on Monday hopefully they turn out they look good so I would give right now I would give them like an 8 plus but we will see Oh, I just ruined one. Try picking some of it up. Aw, 
Aw, thank you. Aw, you guys are all so sweet. Thank you, guys. Okay, I'm taking, like, a little bit out of here because I'm scared that one's gonna, like, overflow and, like, make a mess in the oven and my mom would not be happy about that. Where do I buy my clothes? Aritzia, H&M, Princess Polly, and can I do a... I do not know how to pronounce that, but I know what you're talking about, and I've never ordered from them before, but yes. Is this my recipe? No, I just found this online. You have two dogs too? Aww. Okay, so this is what they look like. This one looks kind of ugly, but now it says to, oops, it says to 18 to 22 minutes. So I'm going to do it for like 18 and then we'll go and check them, um, but I'm going to put them in there right now. What do you think? Do you think these are going to turn out or do you think they're going to be kind of gross? My favorite thing to bake would have to be... Hmm... Probably chocolate cake. I have this really, really good chocolate cake recipe and it literally is the best. So probably chocolate cake. Whoa, that's a lot of animals. Do you live on a farm? Aw, oh, thank you. Thank you. Hopefully they turn out good. Yes, we're gonna wait for 17 more minutes and then we'll see if they're done. We might have to throw them in for a little bit longer. Aw, really? Thank you. Thank you, Shelby. Okay, well, I might start cleaning up a little bit just to like make things organized. Okay. What are you guys doing tonight? What are you guys doing on this Friday? Or it might be the morning for you guys. What are you guys up to right now? Yes, I do. Who are some of your favorite Canadian YouTubers? Um, oh, I'm trying to think. Emma Leger, she lives in Vancouver. Um, she's really cute and um, you're going for a bike ride, helping your mom clean. Oh, that's nice. You're moving, going to hang out with friends. Nice. Wow, such fun. Um, yeah, Emma Leger and, uh, oh no, what's her name? She lives in Orange County now in California. I literally can't remember her name, but she's from Canada too. Um, I don't know a lot of Canadian YouTubers. How do I feel about this pandemic? Well, not very good. I feel like sad that this is happening. And I just wish it could all be over. <sighs> How do you guys feel about this? I feel like it's just, you just go out into like public and it's just so depressing. I feel like everyone is just not happy and I don't like that oh the greatest showman is such a good movie I went to the theater to go see it and then I just kept re-watching it I was like this is amazing yeah I feel like I just want life to go back to normal <laughs> hopefully soon um and how did I meet my boyfriend he worked at the restaurant that I worked at so we worked together right the songs are so good and yes the school year is going to be very different i know like come on it's ruining so many things like come on watching one watching old one direction videos oh my goodness i have a shirt oh my goodness i don't know if i have it still hold on give me five seconds i'm going upstairs to see if i have my one direction shirt still one second
You check one more spot. I don't know where it is. I thought I had it still. I'm pretty sure I do. Anyway, my One Direction shirt said, I heart boys with accents. And I bought that like 10 years ago. I still have it somewhere. I wish I could show you guys. Literally, I think I bought it from like, oh my goodness, I can't even remember. Like Justice or something like that, something random when I was like so young. Kyle doesn't have an accent. I know, he needs an accent. Matt is, uh, I work with Matt, so that's how we know each other. Do I ever feel like acting in a movie or a show? I feel like I would not be a good actor, but who knows, that'd be kind of fun. I don't like to admit that we're best friends. We are best friends, Matt. Aw, thank you, thank you. Happy belated birthday. My birthday is September 2nd, it's coming soon. You think I'd be a good actor? Wow, thanks. Oh, <laughs> uh, almost two years, January 5th, August 29th. Wow, so close, very close. That's so exciting, very exciting. I cracked my phone and I cracked it more, I cracked it once and then I dropped it again today and cracked it more. Not okay. It is gonna be very different. That's so sad. I know, and I was paying for, I don't know if you guys have, I don't know if you guys have Best Buy or anything near you, but Best Buy has this thing called Geek Squad and I was paying $15 a month for Geek Squad, and then I thought once I cracked my phone, I'd be able to get it like fixed. And they were like, no, you need to pay like 200 and something dollars. And I was like, what am I paying for then? So I haven't got it fixed, but I need to. But it's like over $200 to get it fixed. May 2nd. Am I gonna film my birthday hour? Mine? Wait, what? Yes, I will. I'm not in college. Can I sing? No, I'm not a good singer. And Matt can agree with that. He's heard me before. <laughs> Thank you. I should do a live on my birthday. Oh, that would be kind of fun. I'm having a barbecue, I think that night with some of my family, but maybe like later on or during the day or something, I could like pop on and do a little, little live stream on my birthday, that'd be fun. No, uh, no videos. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Canadians are so cold. <laughs> okay, let's see how much time is on here. Oh, still nine minutes. Wow, that's a long time. Aw, thank you guys. You're Canadian too? Wow wins. So am I. Okay, I'm gonna put these away too. And then... Oh! I squished the baking powder, the container, and it got in my mouth, and now my tongue's all numb. What the heck? Not okay. That did not taste good. Oh my goodness. Have I ever been to Ontario? No, I've never. 
I live very far away from Ontario, um, but it would be cool to visit one day. One of my friends that I worked with um, moved there, moved back there. No electronics for 24 hours? <sighs> That'd be hard for me, but I could definitely try. You're in Montreal, you're not, wow, lots of Canadians here. Canadians representing, I love it. My dream vacation, I would love to do a cruise to Hawaii. I've never been to Hawaii and I've been on a cruise before and it was the funnest thing I've ever done. You got two new boxer puppies, that is so cute, oh my goodness. I live in Canada, in British Columbia, Canada. It's still on my lips, the baking powder, baking soda. I don't know which one it was. No, okay, not at all. No, I've never been to the Caribbean. You've never been on an airplane before? I've only been on an airplane going to California, which is only like a three hour flight. So I've never really been on like a long flight before. Can Kyle sing? Ha, he tries, but eh, not really, <laughs> but he tries. I've never been there before, but that would be really cool. Have you guys ever been to Canada? If you guys have never been, or if you guys are not from here, have you ever been to Canada before? Or would you like to visit one time? No, I have never been to Quebec. I've only ever, in Canada, I've only been to places in BC and Saskatchewan. Or Alberta too, I did a road trip to Saskatchewan before. Have I ever been to Arkansas? No, I've never been. Would I prefer to live in Canada or the US? I don't know, well, I would want to probably live in the US because they have like Target and lots of good food restaurants and I would want to live in California, so probably the US, if I had to choose, but I mean, nothing's wrong with Canada as well. I do, I would like to have the best of both worlds and have a house here and have a house there. <laughs> Thank you. Have I ever been to New Jersey? No, I have never been. In the States, I've been to, I did a road trip. I did a road trip to Montana. I was gonna say Montreal. I did a road trip to Montana and I've been to, like Washington and I've been to California and like Oregon that's pretty much all the places I've been to in the US but I want to go to like Texas and like Florida yes those places would be so cool you don't like hurricanes I follow Jess and Gabe um, Conti and they just moved to Florida and you can tell like the weather is just way more crazy there it's crazy Do a video talking Southern. <laughs> oh my goodness, that'd be funny. Hello, Claire, how are you? You live in Oregon right now and lived in Florida. Nice, Oregon's awesome. I like that state. Do a talking Southern, that would be funny. Like go through the Starbucks drive-thru or something. <laughs> they probably wouldn't notice. It's not cold all year round, but right now it's hot. Um, but in the winter time, it does get very cold. Earthquake in, uh, yeah, I was in Disneyland once and there was a huge earthquake and they had to shut it down. It was so crazy. It was one of our last nights in Disneyland and they closed it and I was like, wow, what an ending to this trip. Great fun. You live in Wisconsin, nice. 
in La Virginia. Wow, these are all places I've never been before, but I definitely would want to go there. Okay, let's see. We got three minutes left. Three minutes. And then I'll have to bake the rest of this, but I'm just gonna pull these out and then I'll do a little taste test for you guys and then this will probably be the end of the live stream. You live in Quebec? Nice. Hey y'all, what's going on? Yeah, <laughs> that would be really funny. My aunt is from Kentucky, so she definitely talks like that, but she married um, my uncle who is from Canada uh, and she has a total like Southern accent. It's funny. Have I been to Mexico? Oh yeah, yes, dad. That's my dad, Todd. He's been to Mexico as well. Mexico was fun as well. You want to win? I'm excited to see who is going to win. It's. I wish you guys could smell how it smells in here right now. It smells pretty good. I'm probably going to be linking this recipe because I think it's going to turn out. I have a question. Have you done a MacBook customization? Yes, I, I do. Um, it's a little bit further down on my channel, uh, but I, I do have a video of that. Um, I have a southern accent because, oh, nice. I wish I had a cool accent. Yes, I do have a giveaway. I'm giving away a backpack full of school supplies and I have a video on it so you guys can go enter if you guys haven't already. You definitely need to come to Canada. All right. I literally want to eat this entire bag of chocolate. I have a chocolate obsession. I literally bought a whole bunch of baking supplies because I'm preparing to be quarantined and locked down again. So. Have you, hopefully we could try your chocolate obsession can't. Yes, yes, I filled that backpack up. Make some coffee or drink some milk. Yes, that's a really good idea. That is a very good idea. Of course, I love replying to all of you guys on the comments. I try to reply to everyone, try. I'm, I'm pretty sure I do, I make sure that I do. Every night before I go to bed, I like make sure that all the comments I like are up to date. Right? The Kinder Chocolate is amazing. Oh, really? I love, I love coming on here. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would I want to go? Hawaii, probably. Do I have any advice? Just... Just do things that you're really interested in and just be very active on here and just like always come back. Bake cupcakes. Oh, that would be fun and I could decorate them. Okay, this is beeping. So let's see. Oh boy. Hold on. Oh, they smell so good. Oh my goodness me. So this is what they look like. What do we think? Okay, but I need to try to um, poke them with a toothpick to see if they're done. They might not be done. Um, one second, I'm gonna go grab a toothpick. So this is one of the bigger ones, so let's see. Oh, it's done. They're done. Come back with nothing on them. Wow. Yep, 
they're done. Awesome. So this is what they look like. Hello, Leah. Hopefully I pronounced that right. Yes, that'd be so much fun to go to VidCon. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna let them cool in here for a little bit and then I'm gonna put them on a little cooling rack and then we'll try them out and see. Hello! Thank you! Finally on a live stream I didn't mess up. The last two I did. Okay. Got my cooling racks. I can't. <laughs> uh, I don't think so because I've, I've messed up a lot of recipes. You, I want to take you on a walk between. Oh, that'd be awesome. That'd be so nice. You didn't see my comment, but YouTube. Is YouTube your only? No, I have another full-time job as well. So I'm always doing something, even if it's YouTube or working. Always busy. Ooh, that could be good. That would be fun. Okay, I'm pulling these out now. They smell so good. Like amazing. I wish you guys could smell these. I'm literally going out for dinner after this live stream. I'm hungry. What is my favorite movie? Just go with it. With Adam Sandler and uh, Jennifer Aniston. Actually, anything Jennifer Aniston is in is good. And then any Disney movie, obviously. I would watch any Disney movie. What color braces? Oh, I, the first time I went to get my braces on, I got hot pink and green, lime green, literally alternated all over. That's literally what I got. And then I, I always just went for like the pink. So I think like pink, you should definitely do like a light pink or something. I loved getting, changing my colors. I definitely do, yes. Thank you. I would love to come to Florida. Really? Oh my goodness, twins. We must have must have thought the same. You've never had braces? You're lucky. They hurt a lot. Um, okay. Are we ready for this taste test? We got it right here. Wow, there's a big chocolate chip right there. Ooh, black? I never did black. By the end, I always just did clear. I was kind of over it. I wish, I wish I could share with everybody. Oh no. I'm gonna grab a plate from up here. All right. I'm gonna put some butter on it. I wish I could share with you guys, honestly. I really wish I could. Okay. Oh, they didn't really, uh... oh no. Oh, they're really hot. Okay, that's what they look like. Not bad. Okay, now, that kind of looks like a heart at the top. Isn't that crazy? Oh, that's so cute. Okay, now, let's cut this. Right, I know, I'm like so excited. And then, I need a knife. I don't know a lot. I definitely would want to go there one day though. That'd be so cool. All right, guys. What is my favorite song? Hmm. I like the uh, Charlie Puth song with, what's her name? She, she, 
was on American Idol. The it's called I Hope, I think. That's a good that's a good song. Yes. What's the first thing I think of when I think of Wisconsin? Um, I am pretty sure that Sydney Serena girl is from there, so that's literally one of the first things that come to my brain. All right, sounds good. I will probably see you later. Yes, yes. Okay, here we go, guys. So good. Literally perfect. I'll definitely link these down below for you guys. Everyone needs to try these. Ten out of ten. Mm, perfect. Yeah, literally everyone needs to try them. Try them out and then tag me on Instagram. If you guys have Instagram, tag me. I love you too. Moonlight Bright. Oh, Grace, she was on um, America's Got Talent. She's so cute. She reminds me of like a little mini Taylor Swift. It is 6.53 and my color of my eyes are like hazel. Hello. I will. Every Friday, you guys. Every Friday I will do a live. I don't know if it'll be baking or it might be something else, but I'll always make sure I do a live on Fridays. Everyone definitely needs to try this. But that's going to be the end of this live. It was almost an hour. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed my little baking session and I want everyone to try these out. Um, but yeah, that's going to be the end. And um, I'm going to be posting a new YouTube video on Sunday. And then if you haven't entered my giveaway, enter it and I'll be announcing the winner on August 19th. It's a back to school, school, like backpack giveaway. If you guys haven't entered it, definitely go do that. Um, but thank you guys so much. And I will see you guys in my next live stream or my next video. Have a wonderful night. Bye guys.